They'll be calling you a radical back to Fukushima, back to the reality, back to the USS Reagan soldiers filing suits. So many of them sick, so many of them. We support troops, we support troops. Look at my yellow. No, you don't. Lie, 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 lie. No, you don't. Lie, lie, lie. La 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 la. Back to the blackout of Fukushima, the cover up of Fukushima, the Pacific genocide. Look, here's the lockdown. I want to go clear back to the beginning. As I report this from day one, from day one, first off, I want to say this. There's a video I did on 31511 where I tagged that information in there. Wow, and then they pull it back. Sajay Gupta going on his propaganda war machine freak a thing and they pull it back. All leaked to me. Hundreds of emails inside Japan. All the information, the hearings from inside Japan. People knee jerk and actually did really report this. That we have the emails from the Admiral. We have stuff from inside the situation. We have it all. We got an army investigative journalists that have been on this from day one. Well, they got smart when they retooled this. They retooled this when I was last year at the Millions Man Mass March, which was massive. Massive freaking protest John Anthony and I put together and we led that march and I mean Well, I mean it's gonna be great. I, I'm very excited about it this year And I want everybody to understand too. We're not the anarchists that went crazy and the whole wiki poets and everything that did a hard gig I think it's not gonna be the same this year. Remember they had a breach of security at the White House twice you know, so They're not gonna play. I mean I mean, let's, we have a permit, we're going to do everything right, we, we don't need to break the law, we don't need to break the law, we are peace activists, we are men of peace in a radical, hardcore way, remember this, Aaron Swartz, I dedicated my whole year to Aaron Swartz, my whole life has been dedicated to Michael Hastings, my father, the 40,000 Marines, I've been fighting for those guys for 30 years, nuked. I am Pat fucking Tillman. I've dedicated my whole life to those people. The angels that watch over, the people that have died, us blue angels. I'm going to start calling us the blue angels more. Now, I started wearing this because the chemo burnt to the top of my head. And the blue, as you guys know, I said when I'm dying in there and I had no hair, I went through puberty 12 times. You know, so the pigment burned out of my eyes. I got up like the Great Salt Lake. When it, we had a Great Salt Lake. It's gone now drought on Balco. My eyes were dull gray. Burned the pigment out. Blisters in my throat, in my tongue, going out. You guys have been with me from the beginning. I want to say how much I love all you guys and your support and everything that you've done for me has meant everything. It's been so important that I travel and do this thing. It's cost a lot of money to do this. Plane flights, freaking hotel rooms, but if I don't do it, nobody does it. Megan Rice trial, Megan Rice hearing, twice, you know, up and down the piers, all over, historical record, throwing down the gauntlet in people's face, blue angels, for we defend. Why the blue angels? I'll tell you why. The blue Pacific Ocean. Is that what this is all about? Oh yeah, oh yeah. For wings we will defend the mighty blue Pacific. I fought and defended her, the great blue lady, the mother, the birthplace of all life. I've known this. I've known this when I've had cancer. Life is for the living. I've known this. I've been fighting for her, for those who fight for her, those who protect her, she will protect them. Those who do not, <laughs> you are no match for her, you know. Dot Boy and the rest of them. Some people are just as ugly on the outside as the inside. Huh? <laughs> Did we not prove that? I'm so excited. Aaron Swartz means everything to me. I was in New York City the day he died. The first time I got to travel to New York City. I was in very critical condition. The hospital says, Kevin, we would really like you to go to your place because I have so many ties there. I wanted to go. Very, very sick. January 11th. I went. The only time I broke down, I've only broke down twice, completely really broke down twice. I broke down that day. I couldn't figure out my, my daughter's life. Oh my God. That's the day Aaron Swartz died. Aaron Swartz was a threat to these monsters. They're going to make an example out of him. And remember, they're going to make whoever exposed the secret 
program that's killing the Iranian scientists and their wives and their kids and their whole family. Whoever exposed that, we're going to throw down. We're going to hammer them like they've never been hammered. They're going to be hammered. We're going to make an example like we did Aaron Swartz. Oh, it was the five-star Marine. Oh, there'll be no, I guess not. So, are we, do we have reconnaissance everywhere, my little army? Oh, yeah, we have reconnaissance everywhere. Are we behind enemy lines? Oh, yes. From within? Within the NSA, within the CIA, within the Marine Corps, because there's still men of conscience inside there. They have not all drank the Kool-Aid. On news desk, ha, we haven't got to one of those yet. Five-star broke ranks. Now, you think about that. Think about that. Semper Fi, Semper Fi. I grew up in a Special Forces family. I grew up with one of those guys. I am Pat fucking Tillman. Ha! Ha! Fuckers. So, you think about the people that I defend. They defend me. So the cover-up of Fukushima? If there was a major nuclear meltdown right now in Japan, another reactor, we would not know. If one of the buildings tipped over, we would not know. No. The tsunami? Because of the black and yellow journalistic whores that these fuckers are. The news desk. That's without the fourth pillar, we have nothing. The First Amendment? Ha, our streets. Our streets. Our streets. You fuckers make me Sanche Gupta belongs in a jail cell. Fucking all of them. The beaten the war fucking machine. The church leaders. The fucking scum. But just think about this one component. One component about Fukushima. And there's multi-levels of fucking Fukushima that make this the most evil thing in the history of mankind. The State Secrets Act in Japan. I would get hundreds if not thousands of emails a day out of Japan. I had a huge freaking information base feeding me out of Japan. In September of 2012, fascism, think about that, think about that. This is the great age of technology. The most technologically advanced people in the history of man, I mean, satellite images, they can look inside your window. Huh. We can't get anything out of Japan. Not a photograph, not a camera, not another. Some of the biggest protests in the history of mankind are happening in Taiwan. 85% of the population has been in the street anti-nuclear. Gigant all over, all over the fucking world. Nothing, nothing. Not a photograph, not a, inside Japan, nothing, nothing. People inside Japan, they have no clue. You know, there's people who can do reports on Japan, nah, they don't know nothing, nothing. The American freaking Department of Energy, the evil fucking head that running the show, we know this for a fact. John Holdren inside the situation, handed the keys. At Livermore on day 1000. You don't think that's important I went there? Oh, scary? <laughs> Suicide right there? I wonder why. Wow. The cover-up itself, which I call the Pacific Genocide. Wow. Wow. That part of it alone should have people up in arms going crazy in the streets freaking going mad. Just that piece alone. The Great Equalizer. I always thought for some point, now the CMA, remember the California Medical Association came out last year. I was there. I was in California. Went and interviewed Videos. By myself, by the way, the first round of the USS Reagan, soldiers versus TEPCO. I'm the only one fucking there. The only one. Every day. That's the beauty of this YouTube channel. I can prove all of this. I'm there every day. CMA comes out and makes a statement. California Medical Stage, biggest lobbyist in California. By the way, California really one of the biggest economies in the freaking world. Drought from hell. Fukushima skies, oh yeah, red sky at night, red sky at night, oh boy. The emperor has no clothes. We walk up and down the beach, we hike. Huh, what, what, the ocean's dying, there's no fucking stuff, huh, huh, I've walked up and down, huh, the emperor has no clothes. Hey, yo, fucker, the emperor has no fucking clothes, he's fucking naked. Where the fuck? It's pathetic, it's fucking pathetic. You don't give a fuck. What the fuck's the matter with you fucking people? Just that component of alone. I mean, multi-layered. Wow. Wow. Fucking herd elephants in the room? I'm a fucking carpenter, what's a hammer? I'm a baker, what's a fucking cake? I'm an environmentalist, I'm a fucking hiker, I'm a fucking beach goer, I'm a sur surfers that can't surf, skiers that can't ski, marine biologists that don't even know what a fucking been and ever been on the water. CMA comes out, they make a statement about Fukushima. Look it up. I, I, I fucking broadcast it everywhere. At the USS Reagan, when? The Little League football camps. When the Chargers are on, I'm reporting. Videos to prove it. Huh. 
Emperor has no clothes. Wow! Wow! Unbelievable! So if anything's to happen in Japan right now, how the fuck would we know? How the fuck would we know? They've sealed it up lock, stock, barrel. Talk about it in Japan? Either you go to jail or you end up in your apartment dead. Oh, Aaron Swartz. Huh. We're going to make an example out of you, boy. 35 years in a fucking prison for what? For what? He didn't do shit. He didn't do shit. Huh. That's who we are. First Amendment? Oh, yeah. Fucking dress up like fucking natives. We're natives. Throwing the tea overboard? Oh, yeah. Yeah. You know, the Million Mass Man March. Our tea followed us around. Interview John Anthony. I'm standing there. You know, pretty amazing event. With a police escort, by the way. I arranged that the day before. How did I arrange that? Hey, walk up, plain clothes guys, you don't even won't even know. Hey, Kevin. They're cops. But watch your website, how's this gonna go down? Huh. Here's how I talk to him. Well, you know, we're peace activists. We don't want your kids or your sister or your family or you. We, we love our the children. We love, we hear the voices of our great-granddaughters. We love everyone. We don't want anybody to get cancer. We don't want, we love our enemies. We don't even want anybody to get cancer. We're fighting for you. You the police officer, you the NSA, you the CIA. We're fighting for you. We love you. We don't want you to get sick. We don't want you, because I don't want anybody to go through that. It's horrible. I've been through it. By the way, it'll be three years Saturday. The Light the Night Walk at Sugar House Park. You're all invited to attend. It's the sunset. It's incredibly emotional. We pay homage to the ones that have passed. At LDS, our, our great group, Paul, Carla, Marley, Tracy, Judy, I can go on and on and on. It's amazingly emotional. They do it at sunset. And by the way, if you've never been in northern Utah in October, <laughs> nothing more grand in the world. Nothing more spectacular. It's the most spectacular place in the world. Weather, landscape, all of it. October. It's a sunset. Thousands march. It's very, very emotional. I invite anybody to come with me. It'll be a very it's gonna be my third year anniversary. When I went in the hospital and everybody didn't think I'd make it a day. They didn't think I'd make it two days. They didn't make it a week. My doctors set the goal at three years. They've built a new treatment plan around me. I, I'm curious what they're going to name it. Me and a guy named Brian Morris. Carla had the same thing. She passed. That beautiful soul. They built this plan. I did this without a bone marrow transplant, by the way. First one they know of anywhere who did it voluntarily without a bone marrow. I mean, there's been people that have survived. They sent home to die and didn't die. So they patterned me, but they set the goals at three years. They, Kevin, keep your eye on the goal. Don't you waver. Whatever you do, keep doing it. Living. I didn't lay down. I had no caregiver. I was pinned up against the wall. I fought and clawed and scratched. That's what I did. And I defended her, so she defended me. The Blue Angels. Those angels, they watch over me. I will defend Aaron Swartz for the rest of my life. We, the people, murdered him. I will defend I am Pat fucking Tillman, the execution ordered murder for the rest of my life. I will defend the 40,000 separate five fucking Marines for the rest of my life. I will defend the fucking Marines who had white phosphorus sprayed on them in Fallujah for the rest of my life. I will defend the people of Syria. I will defend the people of Iraq. I will defend the people of Afghanistan because I don't believe in drawing lines and I don't believe in borders. And I don't believe in overdeveloped countries. Underdeveloped I believe in the overdeveloped countries. I call evil what evil. I don't... People are people. The fucking biblical places... I'm not that religious, but in spirit, the light, oh, it shines inside of me. You will never take that from me. Surviving cancer, I hope I've showed the playbook. The cover-up of Fukushima, I have it. I have it all backed up. I have more of it than you will ever know. I backed up in multiple places, and I'll dump it. I've been too sick to dump it on the market. Whatever you do, Kevin, keep doing it. Fighting in the street, walking miles and miles. You know how many streets I've been on? You know where I've been? <laughs> San Francisco in the middle of the night. Compton. In the streets of Compton in the middle of the night. Sleeping on a park bench in the middle of the night in Washington, D.C. Amazing, amazing this path. 
wore holes in multiple pairs of shoes. Huh. The Post Signars Project, yeah, it takes funding. It takes funding. You know, you think these trips are free? You think plane tickets are free? You think hotel rooms are free? You think it's a, no, 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 no. You know, that's the way this gig works. By the way, Palco tried to give me $268,000. Try it. I wouldn't take it. You know? Passing on. Paco gave a lot of people a lot of money. He was dying. He was dying. So who knows how this whole thing, but this whole thing that's spun out of dots and all these, that's not him. That's not, you saw those videos at the end. He was out of his mind. He wasn't out of his mind until the end. All the people that are doing this, they're what we call rats and trolls. They're not him. They're not him. You know, we know who we are. And the angels, they'll watch over me. We're the blue angels. We're the real blue angels. Why the blue angels? Because simply, simply, I told everybody I will dye my hair blue in honor of the mighty blue Pacific if I come out of that hospital alive. I did it. Did it. But I don't have much hair. Chemo burned through the top of my head, through my feet, down my legs. I'm alive. Because we're defending her. And as long as we defend her, she will defend us. And those who do not defend her, black and yellow journalism, as that's my term, not yellow journalism, black and yellow used as a weapon. As a weapon. Sanjay Gupta, Anderson Vanderbilt, freaking, little freaking blitzer. We all know who these CIA rats are. Operation Foxconn. Bill Wright is Stephen Colbert. Stephen, you know it's all an act. If you're an act, what am I? Ha! You fell for it. The mega church leaders all... You want to participate in the cover-up of the Pacific Genocide? You want to participate in the killing of the world? You want to participate in the economic collapse? Freaking stealing the wealth from your children? Well, I hear the voices of my great-granddaughter. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You, Everybody you want to go along, go fucking right a fucking head. Sam Adams, great quotes, and we'll be quoting that very often at the Million Mass Man March this time. RT voted us as the, what, second or third most underreported story in the world. In the, You know, some... Kid and boss, some guy in freaking Utah cooking this thing up. Ha! Huh. Massive. 147 different countries, people would say. Gigantic. See any media? Hell no. Sam Adams. Before they dressed up like natives and threw the tea overboard. Fuck the East India Company. The majority's not our friends. We don't need the majority. We need a simple minority. Who keeps building bushfires and lighting the freaking spark of humanity and men. That's us. We're the new sons and daughters of liberty. Blue angels. Why blue? That has nothing to do with political affiliation. Nothing. Nothing. The sky is blue. The mighty blue, blue, blue Pacific Ocean. Round. Round. The jet stream. So the cover-up, <laughs> I'm digging every angle I can. And the, we're waiting for Janet to rule. And why is Janet not ruled? 46-something days, as I reported over there. And I'm all ready for her ruling. Oh, boy, am I ready. Because they're doing the same thing they always do, the playbook. Here's what they do. Wait till some mega marquee news happens. And then slide it under. Like they made the report, and then, so nobody's paying attention. Nobody sees the shiny ball. That's what they do. If you don't believe me, the NRC turning all... The NRC exposed. Remember when I say 252 sites around the world and everybody says, oh, you're crazy, Kevin. You're nuts. You're nuts. There's only 104 reactors. Huh. I used to use new 252 and I said they got secret ones all over. Nook, cranny, dumps all over. Huh. Huh. Look at the number. Right before Labor Day, it's the oldest trick in the world on freaking, right before. Oh, the NRC with no congressional approval, no illegal, illegal and fuck against, oh, the Patriot Act. Ha. Huh. Patriot Act, mission accomplished. Mission accomplished. Patriot Act, it's over. Huh. Repeal the Patriot Oh, fuck yeah, repeal the fucking Patriot The fucking boogeyman's gonna get you. Oh, no, we know who the terrorists are. And the terrorists work for CNN, work for Fox News. They're mega church fucking leaders. They're the Mormon president of the Mormon church. Those are terrorists. The fucking black and yellow media whores that go along with they're the fucking terrorists. That's the fucking terrorists. They slide that through and say, oh, we turned them all into official nuclear waste dumps. Well, let me tell you something. Earthquakes happen in California. I did lecture after lecture after. Where's it going to happen? Where's it going to happen? You keep saying it's going to happen. Doesn't happen. Doesn't happen. Huh. My lectures for years said it's going to happen in Japan or it's going to happen in Diablo Canyon, San Onofre. Let's hope it doesn't happen in San Onofre. Let's hope it doesn't happen in Diablo Canyon. But it's not a matter if. 
it's when. We got San Lafre shut down. There's four years spent fuel sitting pools on a cliff. Would take not much of an earthquake, and it's over. It's over. Think about the evacuation zone. Get out and look at the evacuation of Chernobyl. Lavers life band from 71 to 52 years old, desecrated. Look at the swath of real estate it takes away. Fukushima. Run of the guy who caught that crazy fish off Coos Bay the other day, saw my tuna. He come up to me. Wasn't militant to me. He saw me in a coffee shop here in Utah. Hey, can I talk to you? Yeah. We talked about the silver streak. The silver streak. Remember, the tuna are the wolves of the sea. The tuna are the wolves of the sea. The silver streak, the spiritual creatures, the only thing surviving in Chernobyl.